Hello everybody and welcome to another video. Now today we're going to be looking at a band I've only ever covered once before on this channel, uh, a band called Pissed On. Now I checked them out two years ago I think when I uh, did a video on their song Grey Flap. Um, now I mentioned I was a big fan of this band uh, back when they first came out they like released two albums in the 90s but they never released anything since then, not that I was aware of anyway. Now, during the time that I was um, confined to a hotel, they released an EP, which I was very, very excited about. I've been looking forward to hearing new music from this band for a very long time. Because, uh, like I say, I, I, their first album, number one, was just an amazing album. I absolutely loved it. I have listened to that thing so many times, you know. I'm surprised I haven't got sick of it yet. And their second album, uh, Sellout, w wasn't quite as good as the first album, but it was still a pretty enjoyable album. And of course, now they've released this new EP. Uh, I think it was released in March, I think it was. Uh, or at least this track was, a track called Cold World, which I believe is the name of the EP as well. So I've been very looking very looking forward to this. I've been very much looking forward to this because, like I say, I enjoyed them. I enjoyed their music. And I, I've always enjoyed Henry Font's voice as well. You know, I thought he had a very interesting and unique voice. Um, so, yeah, that's what we're going to be doing today. Uh, I've got lyrics here, uh, which I'm hoping are accurate. Um so yeah, can't think of much else to actually say on that at the moment, so we'll jump into the video, have a listen, and uh, see what we think. So, Cold World by Piston. Let's have a look. It's a
Well, there we go. Cold World by Pitstone. Now you can probably tell by the smile on my face. I really enjoyed that. Um, now, <clears throat> it does sound distinctly different from uh, earlier material by them, especially like the number one album. Um, there's a little less grit in Henry Font's voice, in the, in the way he sings. The way he sings is quite different in this um, era of music compared to the other albums, but that's sort of to be expected. I mean, like I said, the, the first Pissed On album was released somewhere in the, I think, mid early to mid-90s, I think it was, about 96, 97, possibly, I can't remember, to be exact. And then the Sellout album came out a couple of years after that, and his voice changed distinctly between number one and Sellout. And again, his voice has changed here. Um, so it's not got as much grit to it, but there's still something very distinct about the sound of the band. I mean, you can tell it's pissed on you can tell that's who it is you know the the style of the music the like the tone of the guitars the way it's played it's it's very much them and it sounds great and i really like it um you know i've, I've always enjoyed this band you know and it's it's so great to hear them releasing new material and you know it's been a very long time since they've released anything like new uh, so, you know, the fact that they released this EP just made me incredibly happy. I'm sure there's other tracks on it that I need to check out at some point. Um, so, yeah, very excited, very excited and very happy by this track. Now, I will say with Pissed On, their songs have never been... Well, not many of their songs have been particularly deep. I mean, Grey Flap was to do with mental health, if I remember correctly. Um, it's been a long time since I've listened to the song. Um, but, uh, I mean, this, this song, it's a cold world. It sounds like they're talking about like loneliness, you know, being sort of rejected, maybe. Um, I mean, lyrically it goes, it's a cold world. Well, I despise your indecision. You can never tell me when I'm wrong. Look at all the pain. Look at all your pain in pleasure. Touch my face. I know you'll never know. Here's to all of the disappearing love. And then goes into the chorus. It's a cold world. It's a cold world. It's a cold world when you're alone. So, you know, it's a cold world when you're alone. And the line that came before it, here's to all the disappearing love. You know, it's about, you know, being lonely, rejected. There's a little thing flying around here. It's really annoying me. Anyway. Uh, it says here, well, well I, I can always change direction. You can always tell me when I'm wrong. Open all the aggravation. Don't you understand my love is gone? Here's to all the disappearing love. And then goes back into that. It's a cold world. It's a cold world when you're alone. And there's, there's those lines. Well, I can always change direction. You know, I can always... I can always go and do something different, you know, I can always modify what I'm doing, you know, I can always go and find someone who actually cares, you know, because at the at the beginning it says, I despise your indecision, it's someone who can't make up their mind, you know, do they love you, do they not, do they care about you, are they just, like, settling and just, you know, eh, it's better than nothing sort of thing, and... You know, he's saying, I can always go somewhere else. I can always go and find something else. I can always do something else. Well, at least that's how I'm reading it. It's, you can always tell me when I'm wrong. You know, at the beginning he says, you never tell me when I'm wrong. So it's just someone who's just going along with things. Sort of like, it's like these people that, they they don't fight. They just bottle everything up. And then sooner or later it just explodes. And actually it's kind of like me. Like when somebody says something mean or, you know, something insulting to me, or if they bully me or something like that, I just keep it to myself and, you know, don't don't say anything. And that's a really stupid thing to do, but I can't help it, you know. But this person is like, you know, you can tell me when I've done something wrong. You can tell me when I've done something that's upset you, you know, rather than just sitting there and letting it stew. Just, you know, communicate, you know. Um, but he's saying there, don't you understand my love is gone, you know. Do you not realise that I don't care about you? Do you not realise I don't love you anymore? Because, you know, you're just making this too hard. And then it goes into that. It's a cold world when you're alone. 
Um, uh, then it does a bit where he goes, ah, you know, sort of like, ah. Um, <laughs> Anyway, uh, then it goes back into that chorus. It's a cold world when you're alone, and then goes back into the first, ver uh, goes back into a modified version of the first verse. Um, it says, "Well, I despise your indecision. Look at all your pain and pleasure. I can always change direction or ignore the aggravation. It's a cold world when you're alone." So you say, "No, you know, I despise your indecision. No, you can't make up your mind. You can't decide, you know, whether or not." you know, this is something that you want or if, you know, what we want to do, you know, it, it's annoying me, you know, I, I can't handle this anymore. Um, you know, I can always change direction. Like, like I said before, I can always go somewhere else. I can always find what I'm looking for with someone else or whatever, or I can ignore the aggravation or, you know, I can just ignore how much you're annoying me and just carry on. But, you know, that's not really what I want to do. And it's a cold world when you're alone, you know, you feel so alone, you know, because this person doesn't connect to you. I could be misreading this completely, but that's sort of how it's coming across to me. Uh, but like I said, I, I love this track. I feel it sounded great. It's very distinctly them. Um, I'm so happy to actually hear them producing new material. And I'm excited to see what comes next for them. And hopefully there'll be more albums on the way. Um, but for the time being, we've just got this Cold World EP. And uh, yeah, you can guarantee I'll be getting my hands on that. Um, but don't know what else I can say about that. So I'll just leave that as it is. Thank you all very, very much for watching. And I'll see you again soon. Bye-bye.